Absolutely. Um, I think my mum, obviously, from a young age has been the strongest role model in my life. But in terms of more musically, um, I was lucky enough to be mentored by Kylie Oldest uh, through the MIME mentoring program. And um, she was absolutely fabulous. And she helped me so much with just everything. Like, yeah, she was so great. And then there are a lot of like, people who are on my team and like um who are definitely inspirations to me I guess in terms of like more music industry stuff as well yeah I listened to um I mean I was talking about this the other day in terms of like um artists from Australia I listen to um a lot of Missy Higgins actually and like Nora Jones um and then in my house we had a lot of like Ella Fitzgerald and Amy Winehouse and um yeah people people like that playing Aretha Franklin was always one of my favorites as well uh yeah I think Honestly, like, I think it comes with it. It's really sad that it does, but um, it's pretty common, I would say. It's definitely being phased out, but, yeah, it's, it's definitely still prevalent, for, that's for sure. Definitely, definitely changing for the better, um, but I do think that there's still a long way to go. Yeah, so we just actually released um, a single last Thursday and it's a part of a EP that's coming out on the 8th of April. It's called Glimmer. Um, I'm so excited to finally put this body of work into the world. We were recording it last year throughout lockdowns and um, I wrote it in probably 2020. So all of the tracks to me feel like old, but to you they'll be new and I'm really excited for everyone to hear it. So we're putting together a tour for that one um, and we will be announcing tour dates pretty soon, which is very exciting. <laughs>